What's up guys? And here and today we are going to be opening up not one, not two, not four, but five vivid voltage build and battle kits. Now these things, these are a really big deal. Because first off, every promo that you could possibly get in this is a pretty big deal. You got the Snorlax, you got the um, Dawn Fan, you got of course the Charizard, and you got the Lugia. All of them are just really, really, really awesome, man. Honestly, I want to pull at least one of each here. And if we can get two Charizard, two Lugia, that'd be great. But if I can walk away from this video pulling one of each, I will be a very happy boy. And all of these boxes have the artwork of Zarud on them. By the way, guys, do you plan on seeing the Zarud movie? Well, if you're able to see it. It's like, I, don't, I still don't know what's going on with theaters and stuff. With everything, at least down where we are. But, um, if it's going to release in theaters, and that would be cool, but I would also... It would also be also cool if it released directly to, like, streaming stuff. So we could all able to see it. We have to pay, like, a few bucks to see it like we would a movie ticket. Like, that'd be fine. Ooh, and the first one we have here is the Charizard promo. Oh, I love the artwork on this one. Like, the only bad thing I have to say about this artwork of Charizard is that Leon is nowhere in sight. Which, that makes me very, very sad. By the way, Professor K, if it's a Charizard one, do you want me opening this? The the Charizard? No, don't don't do that. We've already opened up a bunch, so. So don't open up any of them. If they're Charizard promos, don't bother opening up any of them. Actually, don't open up any of them at all because uh, we've already shown the uh, the kits. Good thing I asked. Yeah, thank you for asking. I'd rather keep the kits sealed. Yeah, especially the Charizard. Actually, let's go ahead and open up all the boxes now. So we can see all the promos that we get, and we just do nothing but packs, packs, packs. So we open up 20 packs here. And this one is Lugia. This is one that I personally am a little bit hyped for because it's such an interesting card. Wind pressure for four energy does 250. If your opponent has five or fewer cards in their hand, this attack does nothing. But there's ways to do that. There's ways to get around that. Like, for example, um, you can item lock them, force them to have more items in their hand. There's, um, there's an Alcremie in the set that makes both you and the opponent draw a card on their surprise box to add cards from your opponent's discards to their hand. And again, it's a single welder and a twin energy, and your Lugia is good to go. Like, 250 doesn't knock out V maxes, but it does knock out a lot of things. There's even some tag team GX Pokemon that knocks out. So definitely good to okay we got snorlax next here getting one of each so far please Wait, we have snorlax charizard and what snorlax charizard lugia i still haven't gotten a don fan we still got two more don't worry this is craziness i thought don fan would be the one we get the most of we no. actually had more charizard than anything no because you don't like you and the next one is a charizard Oh my gosh! Are you really complaining about getting multiple Charizards that are sealed? I'm not! I'm not! I just want one Don fan. One! Alright, well, I'm opening up the last one now. <laughs> what? It's Lugia. Okay, I'm not mad about that either, because I only have one Lugia before you did this, so that's actually three Lugia now. Okay, cool. Cool, cool. Alright. So crazy that we don't have Don Fan after opening 15 build and battle kits. Don Fan don't like you. That's all there is to it. He, he just don't like you. Apparently. Alright, so now, with that out of the way, we're going to open up 20 packs of Vivid Voltage. <clears throat> and let's see what we get out of this. The energy to the side. And something to note that even if you do get a green code card, I believe you still have a chance at an amazing rare. You do. So that's definitely really, really awesome right there. Alright, let me move it up so the camera can focus a bit. Alright, so we got Ooh, another donation! Tyler, thank you very much for that three dollar donation! Hi YouTube, love you all. <laughs> love you too, man. Love you too. All right, so we got Ninkata, got a Voltorb, Rock Grove, Weezmer, the Trub Trub, Dewa, I love Dewa, Aromic Energy, Hero's Metal, Reverse Hollow Blitzel, and we got Alchemy. This is the one I was talking about, sharing sweets. 
When you place Pokemon from your hand to evolve, when your Pokemon during your turn, you may have each player draw a card. So it does kind of go with the Lugia here a bit to have your opponent have more cards so you can use the wind pressure. But yeah, that's pretty cool. And it is a little, and I, I do know it's a little like risky to have your opponent be able to draw cards from your own skill. Skill, wow, ability. Wrong card game. But um, I think the payoff's worth it for doing that much damage for realistically low energy cost. Because it's a basic one prize attacker for four energy doing 250 damage. And it's all colorless energy, so there's ways to accelerate that. So you've got, we got, um, next pack here, we have Yama, Glare and Meowth, Dusko, Voltorb, Weedle, Gagoat, got Wide on Stadium, Matang, Reverse Hollow Weedle, and a Darudalon Hollow. Alright. I don't think, I actually don't think I've seen this one yet. Raging Claws for two colors, does 20 and 10 more damage for each damage counter on this Pokemon. Power Blast, 120 discard. Okay, so it's basically Outrage. I remember Outrage. Especially Reshiram Outrage. That actually reminds me of um, from Legendary Treasures, that Radiant Collection Reshiram. Oh man, I remember pulling so many of those that I was sick of it, but like, I love the artwork on it. Like, the artwork was cool. It's just, that was such a common card to pull. I actually don't even remember if it was a rare or not. Alright, next up here we got Dedene, Pick a Pick, Chewbel, Riolu, Chamico, Nuzleaf, Opal, B, a Reverse Hollow Tailo, and Manetric. Alright, so we've only got a Hollow out of that so far. Really hoping that we get another hit here. Even if it's a Green Goat Code, Green Goat, Green Code card. But it's an amazing rare. I will gladly take that. All right, let's see what this last one has for us. We got Eevee, always nice to see. C dot, Electric, Clefairy, Fanfy, Moo Cheese. We got Sabla, Galvantula, a Reverse Hollow Zip Striker, and ooh, Colossal V Max. Colossal. Yeah. Colossal. Oh, co Colossal. Yeah. <laughs> No, no, there's an O there. I was right. Cole of Thal. Colossal. Like, colossal, but coal? Nah. Uh, I don't know. Alright, so we got a VMAX and a Hollow out of that one. Okay, not too bad. This one I know is being talked about a bit, too. Especially for Eruption Shot. For a damage, you discard the top card of your deck. If that card's an energy, detect does 90 more damage, and you get to accelerate onto the Colossal. And doing 240 for 4 energy isn't bad either. Oh my god, can you imagine this thing in Expanded, where we have like 50 different ways of boosting up fighting? Like, seriously, that's a scary thought. And I'm almost not even exaggerating on how many different ways we have to boost up fighting damage over an expanded. Alright, so we got Cottonan, Ericuda, Ninkada, Pikapak, Puccinia, Hitmontop, got Crocorock, Delmas, the Reverse Hollow Stone Energy, and we got a Charizard. Yes, this is a non hollow rare because it did come in a theme deck. Well, there's the one you can replace the hollow with. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. Because I, I want to build that Charizard deck, IRL. It's that one and Eternatus. Those are the two that I would think I would want to have for IRL. And I've got the Eternatus core and everything, too. I just need, like, the stable supporters and stuff. Which, thanks to all the reprints, especially within, like, Champions Pass, that's not going to be hard at all. All right. Next up here we have a Skidoo, Eevee, Treb Treb, Shiapit, Gachudal, Mumu Cheese, Duat, Barathorn, a Reverse Hollow Rare, Ericuda, and we got Snorlax Hollow. Very nice, very nice. Speaking of the um, pre-release promos here. Oh, another $3 from Tyler! Tyler! 
Good luck on the pack, Sen. Thank you very much! I mean, we've gotten two hollows and a VMAX so far, so we're doing pretty decent. I definitely can't really complain much. Alright. Next up here we have... Camera focus, but we got Trub Trub, Tanamo, Clobapus, Wooba, Taylo, Chirisester Bath, got Hitmontop, Shwoobe. Oh, we got a reverse rare Zygarde. I really, really like the artwork on the Zygarde because I like the left side. Well, my left side has um, the blue stuff for X, but the right side has the red for Y. And that's really, really awesome. I love that detail they did. And we have a Galarian Darmanitan V Max. However, Ultra Rares have been VMAXs so far. It's pretty cool. Put those aside. Alright. Next pack. Four. Two. Alright. So we got Execute. Wubat. Baildom. Blitzel. Milky Boy. Excadrill. B. Or Bay, however you say it. Giraffe Rig, a reverse hollow memory capsule. That looks really, really cool. And we have Metagross. Another pretty interesting one. Leg Quick. If the Defending Pokemon is an evolution, it can't attack during your opponent's next turn. So, really, really good for those VMAX decks to just be able to stun them from attacking. And having, and your Pokemon in play have no retreat costs, so. Being able to retreat a Metagross for free at any given time has always been really, really good. Because Metagross is a big boy. Not as big as Tub Chew, but he's a big boy. <clears throat> That's a smart boy. Metagross is a very, very smart boy. Alright, we haven't gotten a single Amazing Rare yet. Really, really want that. Got Galarian Meowth, we got Chemeko, Blitzel, Schlugma, Beldum, Loudred, Wynon Stadium, Zipstreka, Reverse Hollow Lugia, I will definitely take that. And we've got Angry Salmon Toucan. Kid stole his Fruit Loops for the last time. And now, he ain't playing around no more. Oh yeah, I should probably say that the Metagross counts for any Pokemon play, not just itself, so... Thank you very much for that, DJ. Alright, so we got Puccina. <laughs> Charmander. Chaton. Cotne. Joltik. Mightyena. Got Pinkurchin. Laldred. Reverse Hollow Sandile. And we got Aegislash V. Alright, our first regular V. Remember Aegislash EX? Yeah, I wonder how good that was. It also reminds me of the Dialga deck from Phantom Forces. And the full male Dialga ra rarity. That was such an awesome card to pull. That it was. It really, I think it's still worth quite a bit to this day, too. You're right. Just because it was like the only rarity of its kind. Reverse C dot and a better skewna. Still no amazing rares yet. We haven't got any of the uh, the secret rare shiny Pokemon either. Secret rare shiny. Yup. Oh those yeah right. It took me a second because I was like wait that's not till a few sets from now. But I was like nope okay now I know what you're talking about. It's not Hidden Fates 2, but um, the full art secret rare Pokemon that they've been doing. Yes. Ever since the set started, and just a ship three that time. We could get like, an amazing rare or a full art supporter. That'd be great. Yeah, it's just pulling any full art supporter is just always the best. Got Jotik. Sandile, Sidot, Fake Pack, Mudbray, Coding Energy, Hero's Metal, 
Galarian Stunfisk, a Reverse Loudred, and a Drapion V. All right, we're getting we're getting a little more of the ultra rare pulls here. Still need the amazing rare and a supporter. I mean, I guess I could also take a full art Pokemon. It's just always so cool to get the the full art supporters, just because of the just because of how they do their artworks now. I'm not gonna lie, I was somewhat tempted to use my teeth back there. You should have. No. Told you that's not coming back. And as a grown boy now, we've grown past that. Then uh, Shuckle. Ah, oh, reverse Moon Moo Cheese. Ah, the, hey, there's your Don Fan. That's not the Don Fan I wanted, though. Yeah, well, it's the Don Fan you're gonna get, so. Ah. <laughs> Remember when you used to play that Don Fan in back from like Plasma Storm? Yes, that's the one that I took this uh, that City Championship um, semifinals. Yep. Fourth place. Thank you, Don Fan. And that's why, and that's one of the reasons why I love Zoark so much because I was able to get to a City Top Four because of the Veltal Zoark. Ooh, Zapdos Hollow! What, I won that lead cup with for Ninja? <laughs> yep. And the very first time I ever placed at a league anything was a uh, Zoroark deck, so... Yep. I remember... Oh, how we succeeded with our favorites. Yep. I remember that day I literally went home, got my Zoroark plush, and just took a picture. Because they were doing pictures of the top cut, and I literally had my Zoroark there. And I, admittingly, I looked very weird. Use your teeth on the next pack, and it'll donate more. Use your teeth on the next pack? And what? And he'll donate more. Oh, shoot. Shenanigans! Thank you oh, very much for that donation. So now, it's teeth time. Fine. Hello. <laughs> Tyler, thanks for the donation. How's the hair looking? Well, you're gonna find out as soon as he's done here because I shaved it off. Hey, K, how's yeah. the hair looking? I had a taste pack. I don't, I don't like tasting pack. <laughs> All right, so we got Clefairy, Whalmer, Tanamu, Execute, Shatot, Go Go, White on Stadium, Tang. Whatever. A reverse holo <laughs> rare Shay Shay. Rip Shay Man EX. And Ampharos V. I saw the yellow and I was like, is it gonna be the chonker? <laughs> is it going? Nope, it was not Tub Chew this time. You know what's funny? We already have the Pikachu V Max and the V Max Rainbow Rare, but we don't have a Pikachu V yet. Really? I've not pulled a Pikachu V yet. That's weird. Very weird. I haven't even pulled a single amazing yet. And there it is! Yeah. I food taste. <laughs> that's a shame. Ah. For eating the pack. For ripping the back of your teeth. How's that glue taste? Tastes awful. <laughs> tastes absolutely awful. Glad you asked. Thank you very much, shenanigans. Still, still no amazing rare. To no one's surprise, amazing rares on PTCGO are actually, like, people are demanding ridiculous trades for it. For amazing rares? Yeah, but again, especially the Jirachi. Jirachi's good, that's why. Yeah, Jirachi is basically what makes the whole thing even possible. I know people are trying to make an amazing rare, bo like amazing box, but the only way that's going to be even remotely possible is because of that Jirachi. I think we've actually pulled one of every amazing rare so far. <laughs> All right, here's the final pack, and we're closing it up strong. Oh, and also hitting the camera. I'm sorry, <laughs> did not mean to do that, but hey. We're gonna close it off with some last pack magic. 
Or will it just be a hollow? <laughs> I, I, don't, says I don't think it's a hollow, but it felt weird. So we got Rockruff, Taylo, Yama, Whooper, the Dene, Delmas, Trumbeak, Shabla, Reverse Rare Electros, and a Steelix V. Look at that face. He's angry. <laughs> like, that is one pissed off Steelix. <laughs> Like, who hurt him? More poorly, how bad is he gonna hurt the other guy? For real. All right, guys. So this has been 20 packs, five build and battle kits of vivid voltage. Two, three, four, five, six. So on average, we had one one ultra at least in every single box plus one. So that's about what you can expect. From these, at least it wasn't like a no ultra thing. So, which is very, very possible. Because I remember I've done entire pre-releases with the kit and the extra patch you get afterwards, and I still never got a single ultra. And I wanted to cry. But no, we did pretty good. We got our four, got our four of these. We got two of those, and we did get some hollows too. We also got three hollows on top of that, so. Pull-wise, we did pretty good. Pretty, pretty good indeed. All right, guys, if you enjoyed this video today, be sure to smash the subscribe button, hit that notification bell, like, comment down below. Did you say lick? Like. <laughs> Sorry about the lick. Weird up. And if you guys want to see these videos live, be sure to check us out on Twitch. And you can also check us, me, out over at the Magician's Games with Beezus, where we do our own stuff, including PTCGO. Uh, I did not authorize the shameless promotion. <laughs> <laughs> well, I did. I'm joking. <laughs> I will join in donating for Teeth Open Pack. Wait, I will join in what? Donating for Teeth Open Pack. Join in for donating... It's already done, though. Join in donating for Teeth... Open pack. Well, guess what? We have more packs to open, so... Yeah. The YouTube part of it that is watching right now, you <laughs> to see that. However, everybody else is sitting here on Twitch will, so you can end your video now. Okay. <laughs> Alright, guys, so we'll see you all next time. You take care and have a fantastic day.